Guten Morgen. Guten Morgen. Did I say that right? Absolutely. Okay, good. Uh, Fabian Jungnitz, uh, my name is Dashur. I am the director of the Porsche Albania. I have been in the autostrada in the past. I have been 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 in the past. I have Porsche Albania. the past. I have been in the past. I have been in the past. I have been in the past. How long has Porsche Albania uh, uh, been operating and, uh, and uh, how's it been all these years uh, in in uh, in Tirana? Well, actually, we are uh, celebrating in October our 10th anniversary. So it'll be operative since uh, October 2005 uh, in to have our 10th year this year. Uh, until now, things have been going always into the right direction, meaning we had a potential to grow in the market, although there was uh, tough years uh, um, just uh, lying behind us especially since 2011 the market has market has shrunk Slowed down, significantly yeah. but uh, we still always managed uh, to increase our brand portfolio and therefore be also able to increase uh, our market share and uh, also our staff okay um thos ju kan në tetor do të festojnë 10 vjetore në ardhjes në Shqipëri sepse kanë qenë këtu tha për shyesh nga tetori viti 2005 kështu që bën 10 vjet të Porsche Albanians kanë qenë këto vite të fundit disi të vështira edhe pse ne kemi jetu gjithmonë në drejtimin e duar edhe kemi e kemi rritur portofolin e markave tona por por nga 2011 dhe mbrapa ka qenë pak më vështira edhe për shkak të krizës ekonomike me gjitha të gjërat kanë shkuar mirë um, do ta pjesë Fabian e sa njëra spunojnë tek tek Porsche Albanians many people uh, work at, at Porsche Albania? Currently, have, we have a staff of 67 uh, people. Um, and as I said, we did get new responsibilities uh, with uh, uh, increasing our brand portfolio of the Volkswagen Group. And uh, therefore, we have also uh, started with a second location uh, this year. So we are currently uh, increasing the mm -hmm. staff also step by step. You are yeah. expanding. Correct. Just the state of that, I Porsche Albania. Not the moment. I mean, just that for the fact that the radius of the company is so small, I am talking about a new event, a new zero, a new city. The machine is actually just that the two are going to be there for the number of staff. So, um, as far as departments go, people um, do different things in each business. You've got all types of uh, different things. So, how would you divide um, different professions that you hire at, at okay. Porsche? Pra e pjesë për departamentet e ndryshme dhe profesionet e ndryshme që merren në punë të të kjo kompani. I would say that we can basically split it in three main uh, components or departments. Mm -hmm. It's uh, the sales, the service uh, and the administration. Tre janë kryesorët, janë shitjet, administrimi dhe pastaj mirëmbajtja e mjeteve. Uh, in the um, sales department, we obviously have uh, sales staff. Um, in the service department, it's divided between um, uh, service in the workshop, mm -hmm. mechanics, which either do general repairs or body paint shop uh, repairs, mm -hmm. uh, as well as uh, people that handle the spare parts business, logistically and also sales business of spare parts mm -hmm. as well as storage handling. Kemi sidomos për ajan pjesa administrative dhe shitjeve që janë njëra pjesë pastaj pjesa tjetër janë mekanikët janë ata cilët merren me riparimin e makinave që mund të kenë defekte apo me ata që lyen makinën që mund të jenë si flosur për plasur apo rregullimi i trupave të makinave dhe njerëzit që merren me pjesët e këmbimit të makinave ndryshme. Do you find it easy or do you find it hard to find people that are trained to do this work um, as far as mechanics go and uh, taking, you know, body paint and and, mm -hmm. and all of that uh, good stuff that, that, you know, is a day to day business when you work with uh, with vehicles? We find it very hard to find uh, really professionally trained personnel, especially in the service departments. Um, it is it requires special education, usually the that you attended a professional school, that you have um, uh, all this knowledge. Right now, um, mainly uh, it's people that learned it on the job mm -hmm. with years and years of experience. And as I said, with in-house training that mm -hmm. we're doing, but we're lacking this fundament uh, of professional uh, schools that they have attended. E pyes se sa e vështirë është për gjithur njerëz që janë të trajnuar për të punuar me këto makina, e do dini që makinat edhe ndryshojnë dhe janë janë gjithmonë më të elektronizuara, por uh, Fabiani më thotë se është e vështirë, është shumë e vështirë gjithë njerëz që janë të trajnuar në për momentin e punojmë me njerëz që e kanë mësuar zanatin duke punuar me vite e vitet të tëra dhe për uh, duke duke u trajnuar um, no, no, Porsche Albania. So you bring you bring uh, 
let's say, uh, specialists, uh, trainers from Austria to come to, to Albania and to train the people that you hire? Is that when you say in, in-house training? Is no, that what you mean? Basically, in-house training means that we do have uh, our own trainer. Uh, he's sent to uh, Germany, to okay. Spain, to Czech Republic, wherever the manufacturers mm-hmm. are located. Does a, a training course there and then basically on a train, the trainer uh, he brings module, it home. Yeah. he brings it home, he brings it to Albania and then does the training on site in the workshop on the models and cars mm. uh, that we deal with. Ne kemi trajnuas tonin, to të cili shkon uh, her pasere në trajnime të ndryshme që zhvillon aty ku ndodhen edhe produen si të makinave që ofë në Spain, që ki Gjermani, dhe në basi a i trajnohet, vjen dhe e silë të trajnim dhe ndan pasaj uh, me stafin uh, që kemi këtur Shqipri për uh, modelet. Uh, b- how does it work in Austria? Um, uh, 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 let's say high school mm-hmm. yeah? and then you can decide either to pursue the high school uh, way or to go into a profession and you basically start to enter into what we call in austria dual system it's a system where you uh, uh, work for a company you're on their payroll mm-hmm. uh, but you also uh, attend school so you have a lot of uh, uh, absent times uh, obviously uh, from work, uh, from work, mm-hmm. uh, which is uh, coordinated between the state institutions and uh, the employers. Mm-hmm. Um, Do they share the cost of uh, schooling? A- absolutely. There uh-huh. is definitely uh, uh, support systems in place, uh, but obviously the wages of apprentices are uh, very reasonable. Let's mm-hmm. say they're not mm-hmm. uh, they're not as they are for uh, professional mechanics. I understand. And you go through an beginners. education, mm-hmm. beginners, and you go through an education that lasts in the mechanics section, for example, for three years. Mm-hmm. And then you do uh, an exam. Okay. Manuela, this is functioning in Austria. It's interesting. The day in March 2010, the Mund Dieker School and passed Mund Zieders. Now, since that was done, the documents about the future profession that the Mund Filosh put in the company, the Cila Potemi Tmer Si Mechanic, the Mund Tiet, the Cila Shi Punon Me Makinat, for which we have a system in the fish, the Cila Ne Bash Puni Me Stetin, for which we have a lot of data. The Edep Se Mer Pagan, the company, no one put for school the trainers. The other guy who did trainers. Uh, për tre vjen dhe risa ke një provim uh, je i paguar për kostoja për trajnimin dahet midis shtetit që ofron shkollën edhe kompanis që t'ka ty uh, në pun. So after three years you give this exam and you take Correct. that exam then and you, you get a certificate. Correct. Then mm-hmm. you become a craftsman basically uh, and Atër after that një profesionist. and after that you can uh, pursue the career and uh, uh, work, for, work for another um, three, four years depending mm-hmm. uh, how you progress. And then you can make uh, the master's exam. Mm-hmm. Uh, this is the highest um, education then in the professional field that you can have, uh, which gives you additional certifications, mm. maybe also allows you then uh, to start your own business. Uh, this depends then on, 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 the, on the various uh, mm-hmm. uh, professions mm-hmm. uh, that exist. So this exists for different professions, not just mechanics. This is for different fields. Correct, correct. Mm-hmm. It, it exists for all the major professions that you can think okay. about. Electricians yeah. and, correct. and so on. Um, Fabian e bëmë që më sistemi basi t'i ke punuar tre vjetë dhe ke marrë këtë uh, shkollimin për tre vjetë paralelisht dhe merë provimin e parë që të quet, uh, që quesh që ke hyrë në profesion pra ke marrë zanatin, pasaj mund vazhdojsh 3-4 vjetë të tjera me më shumë trajnim dhe risa arrin uh, në nivelin e mjeshtrit. Kur arrin nivelin e mjeshtrit, mund t'hapësht dhe biznesin të ndë apo të progresosh edhe më tej në, në profesion dhe kjo nuk vlen vetëm për mekanikët, por vlen edhe për profesion e tjera si elektricisti, hidrauliku, e uh, but when you become a master, um, that means that you get a good pay, that you have a stable job. Uh, is that is that so? Some perks come with it, some security <coughs> of, of profession and life. Absolutely, mm-hmm. absolutely. I would say that this is uh, definitely people that are valued, uh, valued by in the society, value in the job world that they're looked for. Yeah? Mm-hmm. We always say, I mean, a good craftsman um, is somebody that is always needed. Mm-hmm. Yeah? 
Edhe mbasi arrin këtë nivelin e profesionalizmin dhe të mjeshtrit, mbasaj ke jetë të mirë, a i ma konfirmonë se kjo ishte pyetja, paguar është mirë, je, je në kërkes gjithkohës njërës i duan, duan që të të marrë në punë pra, dhe mbi gjitha ka edhe një, nga ana e shosheris një stimul, pra një loj vlerësimi për, për këta mjeshtra. Nuk, nuk i shikojnë si njërës që rrinë për shmakinës i ditën, por si, si mjeshtra dhe profesionist vërtet. When we come to, uh, let's come back to Porsche Albania for a little bit. Sure. Um, you sell different, uh, tell me about the different types of cars that you sell uh, here. Pius Bërcilat janë modelet e tipet e ndryshme të makinave që mund njeni tek Porsche Albania. So we're the official import in Albania for all the Volkswagen brands mm-hmm. right now, which consists of um, the, let's say, more upper class brands, uh, Audi, um, as well as Seat, Skoda, and VW uh, passenger vehicles, mm-hmm. as well as uh, the commercial vehicle section. Um, we Audi, Skoda, Volkswagen, We also do trade the brand Porsche um, a little bit, but as we have a very uh, small, um, high price vehicle market in Albania, it is only a few numbers uh, a year. Uh, vetëm një, po shesim që thashtu edhe një numër të kufizuar uh, të modelive të Porsche pasi uh, tregu për makina të shtrenta të asaj të ati që mimi është, 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 është strange thing is you see a lot of Porsches in the street por, ka shumë Porsche në rrug me gjithë, so, so they don't come from you no no basically. that's absolutely correct I mean we have in Albania a massive used car market mm-hmm. um, this is also uh, because of uh, used car laws that have been in, becoming in force several years ago which make it uh, extremely easy to import vehicles mm-hmm. uh, and that's the reason why there is a lot of used cars on the road and this goes not only for low-priced cars but also, also for luxury and high-priced vehicles. So, so tregu për uh, importin e, e makinave të përdora në Shqipëri është goxha i zhvilluar dhe ligjet janë të, të lirat pra, të lehta për, për cilë një makin në Shqipëri. Um, so uh, to work for uh, for these vehicles uh, to service these cars um, because they change all the time you know and technology is progressing so fast uh, models for example uh, 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 Volkswagen uh, Golf Make 4 uh, is very different from a Make 6 and a 7 is coming soon um, so now you've got all these buttons and all these electronics and all these signals uh, whereas before you work with metal and uh, you know hoses and you, you just tighten uh, these things up it means that, that you need to be trained all the time and, and things are changing and progressing and and you have to stay on your toes you can't just relax and say well i'm a good mechanic i know how to do this yeah this is absolutely correct i mean we have um, the technology doesn't stop uh, at the vehicle side i mean you have your laptop in front of you you have wireless you've all these uh, technologies that are approaching us and it doesn't stop at the vehicles mm-hmm. so clearly that uh, technology has advanced and it's getting more and more harder for uh, the dealerships uh, to basically cope with all this technology. E pjes për për zhvillimin teknologjik makinat tani janë shumë zhvilluar, janë të mbushura me kompjutera, nuk janë mësin përpara dhe mekaniku nuk mund të qëndroi në vend numero me ato që dinte para për modelet e po themi viteve 90 apo 2000 sepse gjëra ndryshojnë shumë shpejt. But a lot of the, a lot of the, the, the vehicles also have uh, entertainment. Uh, I mean uh, you know usbs and movies and uh, in the back seat you can have you know uh, a screen to watch to watch things so 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 you must also because we speak of mechanics mm-hmm. but but there's a whole thing uh, yeah. you know this it uh, type deal mm-hmm. that you have to uh, to also take care of it goes more into the direction of mechanical engineering mechatronic mechatronic as we mechatronic. call it mm-hmm. mechatronic as we call it yeah um uh, because uh, there is a lot of a big technical side to it We do have diagnostics uh, in the workshop that only deal uh, with um, uh, computers, basically. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. They run search programs. Uh, they try to find bugs. Mm-hmm. So they focus mainly on, on, on this kind of work. They, they are not, the cl- in the classical sense, the people that really get their hands completely right, exactly. dirty. They do a more, uh, let's say, engineering, uh, engineering. work. Mm-hmm. Shumë nga makina për shkak se janë kashtë avancuara nga anë teknologjike dhe ka të sistemet e brendshme për shumë të argëtimit në makin, kërkojnë që këta uh, njërës që mërëmën të të janë ingjinjer, jo thjeshtë mekanik për, të janë ingjinjer që njojnë uh, kompjuterat dhe që punojnë me kompjuterat. What would be your uh, uh, suggestion, what would be best 
uh, for Albania to develop in order to uh, a system maybe like Austria's in order for 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 young people to get trained and, and to find good jobs and, and uh, you know a profession in life and but also for for your part you know to, to have an easier <coughs> time finding people that you you might want to hire and, uh, and and staff mm -hmm. your uh, your companies well I think uh, it's it's not up to me to, to tell to Albanians no, or to Albania what to do obviously huh? uh, I think uh, you're in the luxury position that you can look around. Mm -hmm. You have like a, a table uh, of options. Uh, you go through, you send a few guys out in Europe and you just uh, look around. What is, a, a what, what, is a, what is a model that you think would work with the mentality, with the culture that mm -hmm. your uh, Albania has and, and go for that. But just really do something where you say you give youngsters the chance to professionally follow a career and to start it in the early age. Yeah? Because as far as I know, uh, what concerns demography, demogra demographics in, mm -hmm. in Albania, yeah. with a very young yes. uh, population, which is a great source Uh, of, of potential. Uh -huh. Uh, Mua You're welcome. Thanks for having me. I think I see Czech Jimmy too. Mr. Dasher Fabian Jungnitz, Nga Porsche Albania, I genuinely know the strata and Tiran Duras. Ashtë fare pranë atje dhe të gjithë modelet e branded e të markës Volkswagen gjithashtu. Falim derit.